basic training like in the army. <clears throat> basic training in the army is not it's not really hard, it's just mentally challenging. Like you just gotta come there with an open mindset. Cause and come there in shape, ready to know how it is. If you come in shape, you come in with an open mindset and you're respectful, then you'll be good. Because the only part that's challenging is doing the rut marches in the cold, walking like 20, 30 miles, 40 miles in the cold with no cold weather gear on. And that's pretty much it. Like, as long as you, if you can get through that, you can you, you can get the rest of base training. Cause they're gonna show you how to shoot, so you you learn how to, how to qualify with your weapon for your weapon. Um, if you come there in shape, then your PT test is not gonna, passing PT test is not gonna be nothing. Cause you do PT every morning, literally every morning, and throughout the day. So passing your PT test is not gonna be nothing. Uh, that's pretty much it. Like, really, the training is not hard in the army. It's just mentally challenging. And you just gotta, when you find yourself about to give up, just think about why you join and push through it. Like, right? you're gonna do a lot of, you're gonna do a lot of walking. You're gonna do a lot of running. Run, I think run day is just what every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Yeah, Monday is like every other day. And then Tuesday and Thursday, you have muscle failure. But but for me, towards the like, for like the last three weeks, we did muscle failure every day. That was aggravating, but it is what it is. Uh, oh, and before you go there, um, you can look up online the or the army song and the army and the soldier's creed because you're gonna have a test on that and you have a red face test, a blue face test, and a white face test. It's red, white, and blue. Those are three phase tests, and you gotta pass each one of those in order to go to the next phase, or you're gonna get recycled. You do not want to get recycled at basic training because you. you Base training is originally 10 weeks, or already, already 11 because of reception. But say you get recycled, that instead you're doing 10 weeks, you might do 15, or you might do 20 weeks. So you don't, trust me, you don't want to get recycled. Uh, what else? Oh yeah. Sleeping in the cold when we go on a rope. Okay, every rut march is like when you, when you go on a rut march, that's like your it's like that's that's part of your test too to go to the next phase. Cause at the end of each phase, you can have a rut march. And then you spend for the hammer, you spent we spent what two days outside, then you got sleep in the cold. The anvil is three days and the hammer is, I mean the forge is four days. And, and you just like you just you do a lot of wrecking with a like a sixty pound wreck on your back, and you sleep outside, and you eat MREs, like man, yeah, like all of it is just like really mental. It's just you just gotta come mentally ready. If you if you prepare yourself mentally before you go to basic training, it, it's gonna be it's gonna be a, a breeze. Cause it's actually kind of fun. Cause a lot of trainees do some dumb stuff, and that makes it hilarious. Cause I find it funny when people do dumb stuff, and like, not when people do dumb stuff and get in trouble, but like, they do dumb stuff. Like they'll be walking, like just trip over themselves, and like, they just be doing dumb stuff. Come on stairs with their pants on backwards. <laughs> And by the time we had some, we had trainees do a lot of dumb stuff, like a lot. <laughs> uh, don't be one of those people, though. Don't be one of the people who always messing up, because the drill sergeant will recognize you. Like, and like when y'all have class, 
like you like your briefings and stuff don't go to sleep trust me do not go to sleep um don't be one of the people who's always late to formation try i was pg in basic training so, and like i really liked it it's just it just comes with a lot of responsibility, right? But that's with that's for, that's with any leadership role. Try to get PG. And, but like back to the coming late the formation, the, don't don't be one of the last ones to formation. You can get in trouble for that. And plus, at your duty station, if you're late to formation, that's a easily FTR. And the counseling, so don't don't come late for formation. This is basically, I'm to to make this video short. Do what you told, how you told, and when you told. As long, as long as it's not nothing that's gonna put you in any type of harm. Well, for basic training, as long as it's not nothing that's gonna put you in any type of harm or like morally wrong do it and don't get smart with the drill sergeant don't try to have no attitude with the drill sergeant nothing like that you're just gonna you're just gonna make you're just gonna make it harder for you basic training is literally it's, it's how hard you make it like if you and your bad buddies are squared away you better have fun at basic training if you and your bad buddies want to do whatever you want when you want your basic training is gonna be extremely long but yeah that's pretty much it. This is Phase TV, and I'm out.